Speed. 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 Speed Cafe. Speedcafe.com.au. Your daily racing fix. Yeah. Welcome back to the Irwin Summer Grill. I'm Grant Rowley. I've got Cam McConville here with me. And today we're looking at Paul Dumbrell, one of the most improved drivers in the V8 Supercars Championship Series. He's been around for a long time. He's still a young guy. And this year he went through some up and downs with uh, retiring, not retiring, some fantastic results. His first win. Cam, what do you think? Oh, standout performance uh, from PD. I mean, to be the CEO of a major automotive company in uh, automotive brands, as it's called, which is uh, Autobahn, Auto Pro, uh, huge responsibility stepping up to take that role from his father. And V8 Supercars is such an intense industry. It's, a, it's like being an AFL footballer. It requires a massive amount of your time. One of the reasons why I step back from full-time racing and I'm running a small business, and to think he's doing that, did an Ironman, won a race, got pole, PD, awesome effort. And uh, I think other than James Courtney, for me, he's the standout performer of this year. He just got it together. And it goes to show too, when a race team and a car suits the driver, that there are quite a few guys out there with the ability to do the job. Now, PD took his first win at Sandown. Uh, and it was also the first win for Rod Nash Racing. We caught up with Rod Nash after his victory. Tasmania was fantastic to finally climb aboard that uh, wonderful podium area. Um, uh, for myself, you know, 13 years, and for PD, not too far behind, uh, well over a decade uh, without a podium, so um, a bit hard to sort of explain the jubilation that uh, goes through you, uh, finally earning that status, but uh, to go then, or to have a, another race meeting a week later, and then uh, he goes and um, uh, starts off the front row, wins the race, the next day puts it on pole. I mean, uh, it's almost as if, um, you know, you sort of say, we'll slow it up, you know, like uh, we're achieving a little bit too much. Uh, that was Rod Nash. And can PD now become a championship threat? He's decided to go on for one more season. Does he have what it takes to be a champion of V8 Supercars? Oh, I think uh, the word threat, Grant, is 100%. I think he's a, a championship threat uh, for sure. Can he win it? Look, I don't know. Can FPR win a championship? That's another question as well. So uh, I think he needs to be perhaps a little bit more consistent because uh, occasionally he was back at the back end of the top 10. But uh, look, if PD can run in the top five every round, he's got to be in there and he's got to be one of the contenders for next year. That's Paul Dumbrell. You're on Speed Cafe, the Irwin Summer Grill.